What is up, Clemson Nation? What's up, TTC? Guys, what a great win for Clemson last night. Uh, sloppy win, but we hold on 40-35 to to get the win over Ohio State. Um, you know, it was definitely a good win for the program. Clemson's the only team in the country that's beat a top-10 team in a bowl the last two years, so that's always good. Uh, it was good to get a BCS Bowl win in the last opportunity, something that had a chip on our shoulder a little bit, obviously, from the first go-round, but um, it was good to get back to the Orange Bowl and get a win against a team that nobody likes, nobody wanted to see win except for a few people, and uh, it'll be good. It'll be a good year living in South Carolina, seeing all these Ohio State fans and all these tourists coming down here and wearing my Clemson stuff proudly and pissing them off a little bit, so that'll be nice, uh, but it was a good game in Ohio State, put up a good fight, good back-and-forth game, but I'll tell you what, man. The mistakes by Clemson kept Ohio State in this game for most part, and it was just some sloppy, sloppy stuff that, you know, from a coaching standpoint, has got to be cleaned up. It's something that we didn't see much in 2012, and uh, I thought we had improved a lot on it, and, you know, this year was just extremely sloppy. Not many fundamentals in the last half of the year, ever since that Florida State game. It's just been like fundamentals were thrown out. You know, you saw people grabbing face masks stupidly, just stupid penalties. And, you know, of course the refs made some horrible calls, but there was a lot of stupid stuff that Clemson did too that hopefully we'll improve on uh, coaching-wise next year. But also, how about Sammy Watkins, man? What is he capable of? Two hundred? What was it, 227 yards he finished with? Some just outstanding catches, outstanding plays, MVP of the Orange Bowl. Can't wait to see Sammy in the NFL. Um, you know, shout out to you, man. And Hot Rod's last game, man, he played pretty good. And Vic Beasley, other than that stupid penalty, you know they're going to call a penalty on that. But other than that, man, he played outstanding too. Uh, Shuey played great in his last game. Everybody who was playing for the last game, they, they put up a show, though. I mean, Martavis Bryant put up a show. I mean, it was... It was a good night for those uh, guys going out. And Taj Boyd, even though he made a crucial mistake at the end of the game and a stupid little flip pass when he probably could have scored, other than that, he played an outstanding game. Um, made better decisions, I think, than he did a lot of the times this year, other than that one flip. Um, and just, it was just a, a great game to watch. It was entertaining. You know, came back from 9 down after coming back from 11 down in the second half last year. So. Another comeback win. That was exciting, and we got the turnovers we needed. I'd been talking about earlier in the year that we didn't get the turnovers we needed. We got the turnovers we needed this game, and that's what you know started that comeback and put us in the lead, 34 to 29. And of course, from there, we all know what happened. Uh, just outstanding, outstanding game by Clemson, and it's definitely something to to ease the pain of the things we didn't accomplish this year that were the ultimate goals, but to get a BCS Bowl win, that was definitely one of the goals, uh, and, we, and we got that. So I'll have a post-season video, season wrap-up coming out sometime soon, and also talking about the future of Clemson. It'll be the most interesting off-season since going into the 2011 season. We've got three people competing for the starting quarterback spot, and, uh, you know, people competing for the starting running back spot. We were losing pretty much all of our offense uh, so but we got a ton of talent coming in and a ton of talent already here and it'll just be an interesting offseason to see who steps up and takes the place of our players who are leaving so go Tigers 40-35 over Ohio State great win let's get ready for 2014